What's going on, people? It's your boy, Dramatic, a.k.a. Skip Beardless, and I got some news for y'all. We have changed our release format, so we, <clears throat> we will be releasing episodes Tuesday and Thursday on YouTube, SoundCloud, all our social media. So check us out. Lock us in on Tuesday and Thursday on your calendar about 5 p.m. every day and in the morning for the YouTube link. Just lock us in Tuesday, Thursday, TPSG. Peace. The time when niggas was just Uh-oh. chilling with nothing to do, there was one podcast, a one podcast alone, worthy of your time. And it's us! <laughs> oh shit, I thought I was watching Game of Thrones for a second. <laughs> what's going on guys? Yeah. Chilling, chilling man, what's good? Back for another week on the ass? Word. What's going on? Your favorite podcast, The Physics Study Group, hashtag TPSG. Mm-hmm. You can Back for good. another week, how y'all fellas feeling? Feeling good, feeling great. How are you? Ah, I see what you did there. Uh, no. <laughs> but yeah, man, we back for another week. And unfortunately, um, we're down a squad member. Mm, let's run so, down who's here first, though. Oh, damn. Okay. Who's that to my right hand side? It's me. It's Mr. Dramatic, <laughs> a.k.a. Black Galifianakis. And um, what I called myself last podcast, Skip Beardless. <laughs> That's a damn good... Name, yeah, man. It's My com- head almost exploded when I when I thought of it. it it's yeah. coming back though. You kind of look. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? We're getting there. I'm at the um, you know, you notice it level. Yeah. Like yeah. oh okay. <laughs> that's the that's the name of that level. Like oh okay okay. You, you're supposed to have facial hair. Yeah, exactly. Well, yeah, it's not all there yet. That, yeah. You you look like um you know the when white people stop working for like a couple weeks. <laughs> yeah, in shows they get that that yeah. crazy beard. The five shit. o'clock shadow. Yeah, that's the that's the I'm not doing well beard. It's like in For between, real. like I did it. It's in between. I did this on purpose, and I'm just starting. So yeah, right there. I'm not doing well beard, and this is Flock of Zulu, <laughs> aka Sir Black Stallion the Third, aka Pablo Escovich, aka aka Five Dollar Footlong. <laughs> that's a throwback. Okay, but a throwback, has. throwback. Okay, okay. For the tr- tr- throwback church, <laughs> throwback for the tourist day. <laughs> <laughs> or, or Tuesday, deciding on which <laughs> on when we decided to drop this. No, it's take it back Tuesday. Mm, take it back. Way Tuesday. back Wednesday. Flashback Friday. Ah. Send it back. Sa- I'm kidding. No, Memories so, Monday. So it, it's pretty much <laughs> Memories Monday. <laughs> so it's pretty much post old pictures whenever the fuck. For real. All right. Yeah. Here, how I use the look. <laughs> No, you got a hashtag that applies to all of them. <laughs> Word. <laughs> it's your boy David Bomaye, aka Chico Fantastico, aka Sirac Obama, aka Debo Who That? What by? What by? <laughs> what by? Uh, Nigga, the bitch cruiser. <laughs> what well, another week? You know what I mean? Yeah, Word. man. And um, unfortunately, our Word. boy Shavi, but but up, but up. Yeah, uh, shabby rankings. Yes, See, I kidnapped the end, y'all boys, bro. But Again. this time, I, I don't know. But I don't know if we can guarantee him back. Is yeah, he, he he got taken by extraterrestrials. Yeah, they're from the south end of Saturn. Mm. The south they're called the uh, what are they called? The ring lawns because they live on the ring. You know, oh, uh, yeah. true, true. Yeah, and um, they're probing the shit out of our boys. <laughs> No pun intended, if you know what I mean. Every single possible hole you can think of. Oh, Holy shit. shit. Damn it. Where did you get that update? Damn. Oh, yeah. So we, we, we communicate uh, with the aliens through WhatsApp because WhatsApp, you can text any fucking body anywhere, apparently. WhatsApp is a fucking beautiful invention. And um, yeah, he's no telling, like, you know, giving us updates. Still alive, but he wish he wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's dark. That's bad. And see, he's gonna be mad. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna be mad when you hear this shit. Right. Yeah, yeah. he'll be alright. But yes, but yes, we're, um, we're back for another week. So, guys, I don't know. It's kind of an obscure topic this week. Yeah, like, well, this episode. This ep- I haven't. I haven't had episode. A, yes, I haven't had a pet in a while. Mm-hmm. Like dog, cat, hamster, whatever. Right. I haven't had it in a while, and I'll still buy another one. And, you know, lately. I've grown a love for cats, yeah. but I was always a dog person. But I appreciate cats. Yeah, mm. 
Well, so, I'm caught on the fence. Like, should I get a cat? Should I get a dog? You kidding a puppy? Today's episode <laughs> is cats and dogs. Mm-hmm. We gonna help dramatic decide. Where? Oh shit. Where? What are we? Are we cat people? Or are we dog people? So, so, so let me ask you. Are Sergio, we both? Mm-hmm. Well, Do we even like animals? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck them all. <laughs> <laughs> you mean I need to keep this shit alive? Fuck that. <laughs> For real. Mm. But um. In all yeah. seriousness, what what? You know what I mean? What started this transition towards your affinity towards cats, man? I don't know. I, I chilled around them more. And, like, I noticed the thing with cats, they really like children. <laughs> like, it's weird. Cats love adult, adults and older people, from what I've seen. Yeah. I'm probably wrong in the spectrum of things. But, um, <laughs> yeah, I noticed, like, you know, you don't notice a lot of kids having cats as pets. You know, they have a kitten, mm. but don't have a cat. You know what I'm saying? Like cats aren't a lot of fun. Nah, they, I disagree. They don't be with the you. Don't know how to have fun with cats. That's well, they no, do. they're not a they're not a lot of fun to like kids because their cats aren't. Well, let me not, let me not say cats aren't fun. Cats aren't as interactive. No, yeah, that yeah, that's my point. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You can't you can't take a cat outside and be like, hey, let's play some catch or hey, let's. That nigga run look at you and right. scurry back inside, exactly, nah. and eat his fancy feast. Word. <laughs> Weird. He look at you like he was crazy. For real. But um, I've always loved dogs. So I've had dogs, you know. I've I've had dogs that, that had um gave birth to puppies, and then mm-hmm. those puppies gave. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've right. had lines of dogs. Mm. But um, yeah, I don't know. As I got older, I just a little appreciation for cats. Where I don't know. I'm the same way. I I've had a pet for a while, but um, I've always always had dogs. But this was in Jamaica, mm-hmm. where you could just let mongrel. Me, yeah, you could let. For, yeah. <laughs> I had a, shout out to Shabu, rest in peace. We had a dog, mm-hmm. and it's like we like every like we had a yard and shit. So we just let him roam, shit where he shits, do what he does. I feel and here here you gotta like clean up after your dog. You gotta like yeah. make sure your dog doesn't <laughs> fuck another dog and or, or do some wild shit in another in another yard or something like. I feel like upkeep for everybody, every, every animal here is more, but like. Yeah, dog. Like we used to they let. Got to sleep in your bed and shit. Yeah. Where you got to keep niggas your keep dog, dog in the face. Where inside dogs is wild to me. Like you keep a dog inside, nigga. Like he's supposed to be roaming the wilderness, bro. But we used to like our dog will literally open the fence, go roam the streets, uh-huh. and come back late at night. Mm. Okay, you know what I'm saying. So I he was it, a G. <laughs> where so it was almost like a, having a cat up here in terms of like maintenance, where you could just let that nigga do whatever. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, but, but you, I think here like you need dogs need too much attention. Yeah, they need insurance and shit. Yeah, <laughs> so I, mean, I, I yeah, feel it's like a different I, culture. Here, word. Right? I feel like I would, now I'd prefer a cat. Yeah, no, yeah. Like, cats are low maintenance. Mm. You just know, what feed them, pour some litter in the box. They you do know, they thing when they want. Yeah, regular vet visit is good. They mess with you when they want to, or they yeah. don't mess with you when they don't want to. Yeah, right. I don't yeah, know it, the, the way I like the easy distinction I saw. Like dogs are excited for everything all the time. Everything, yeah. <laughs> right? Like, like you got to work for a cat's affection. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and even if the cat likes you, just might not want to mess yeah. with you. Yeah, no, this he moment. probably just wants <laughs> something right now. Like, like all right, yeah. you are giving this away? I take it. In five minutes, get away from me. Yeah, like, like, why you? This ain't nothing me? regular. What's wrong with you? Right. <laughs> right. But um, now, you always hear the biggest difference between like cats and dogs. You know, they're more enemies or whatever. Blah blah. blah. Yeah. But um, I'm gonna read to y'all twenty three of the weirdest facts about cats and dogs. Cats and dogs. And I read the first one by mistake. You know, we're trying to get that raw reaction. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And um. But yeah, 23 weirdest facts. The first one, I didn't even want to read past the first one. I was like, wow, that's false. <laughs> like, that's true. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So um, the first one, it says, cats are lactose intolerant. What? Every crazy, cartoon yo. I've ever seen in my entire life. They drinking milk. Grown cats drinking milk. Right. They, they baby, cause baby cat kittens drink, drinking milk. Drinking milk like that shit's ambrosia. Like, Bruh. Like it's, <laughs> like it's the last scale. thing on earth. Like that shit gets them drunk. They're, now, it says, like most mammals, cats lose the ability to di- digest dairy after infancy. Feeding milk to a cat can call, it can encourage stomach upset and, and diarrhea. Imagine, I don't need cat diarrhea in my Yeah, house. I'm about to say, imagine yeah. cat diarrhea. Yikes. Even though it's in a litter box, I still wouldn't want to clean that up. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A producer who who owns two cats is shaking his head profusely yeah, like, like you nah, don't, he said you don't you, want these issues. You don't want these <laughs> problems. You don't want these problems, bro. You don't. Now number two, dogs with squashed in quotation mark faces have more health problems. It's like bulldogs and stuff. And I believe that. And I, I always thought that. I was kind of judgmental of them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Th- like pugs, ugly dogs. Uh, pugs are so overrated. I don't know why people like pugs. Because they're ugly. <laughs> they they find they find like a cute they find a cute cute or like a amusement yeah. in the ugliness. Yeah. Man. But that nigga might have mm. a heart attack tomorrow. That's why I have hugs. No, I'm yeah, kidding. so like bulldogs, <laughs> boxers. Bugs, yeah. Um number three. Cats are capable of about one hundred different. Cats are capable. Of oh. about 100 distinct vocalizations. Dogs are capable of about 10. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow, really? I hmm. actually believe that. Like, being around being around cats a little bit more, you hear... It's not just a regular meow. They be having... Meow. You hear the meow, meow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's true. Like that's such a weird it. fact. <laughs> <For Good. real. laughs> all right, number four. I think um, all Dalmatians are born white. <laughs> no, I think I knew that. I didn't know I that. I think I knew that. I didn't know Their that. Their spots develop within the first few weeks of life. Yeah, I think I knew that they were born white. I think they showed it in 101 Dalmatians, right? Mm. Maybe? No? Okay. This makes sense. Yeah. Hunting is not an instinctive cat behavior. If mm. a kitten doesn't learn to hunt from its mother or other cats, it is unle- unlikely that it ever will. Oh. Mm. That makes okay. sense. That makes sense. Where else are you going to learn from? Where? Because when True. you... Because like cats... Even in the wild, they spend a lot of time developing under like their parents. Uh-huh. True, true. Tons you know what I'm saying they they don't they don't stray away. You know, some animals as soon as they born, like they is like niggas. You on your own, nigga. Like, yeah, from <laughs> from the jiggy. Where, <laughs> where so, so, some eat their parents and just be like, you know, next generation, bitch. <laughs> For real. But I, like, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, no, no, that does make sense. That does make sense. What? You can't really be born with violence, right? Where, yeah. In you like that. So hey, that's that's important information. Like if you have a cat, yeah, and you decide you don't want this cat anymore, releasing that cat into the wilderness is not a yeah, good idea. Yeah, he might die tomorrow. He's gonna die immediately. Yeah, yeah. immediately. I mean, he's, he's not. He's not. Literally, he's not built for that. Where? Let me stand <laughs> here and wait for the catnip. For and now I'm dead. I'll obey you. I'm sorry. I'm like, sorry. oh, you gonna feed no, me, no, right? No, no, no. But no, you gonna be sitting around waiting for food instead of looking for food. Exactly. You know? He doesn't know how to. And the cat's going to take his fucking food. I would, <laughs> I would imagine, like, street animals just punking the shit out of that cat. <laughs> <laughs> like, my... Squirrels walking up, slapping this <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Fuck out of here, bitch ass nigga. Fuck wrong with you. Fucking inside cat. Wait, <laughs> fucking oh, in cat. Indoor. My, is, is that how they treat a the house nigga? My, my, yeah, probably. Mice just walking right by this For nigga. For real. <laughs> this, you, you were <laughs> pointing in the cat face. This nigga... This nigga, are you kidding me? He ain't Fuck go, this nigga. He ain't gonna do shit. You crazy? Look, I'm looking at a cat. You don't even know what to do. I right bet now, you a chunk of cheese. I slapped the shit out of this nigga right now. <laughs> he saw for some cat food. <laughs> <laughs> and the cat just confused. What's happening? Oh, you ain't got no massa cat. Oh, oh you a pussy. Ass. We been massa free. The <laughs> fuck you mean? Oh. <laughs> that is literally like a metaphor for like if you shelter your kids too much and then send them to college. For real. <laughs> You gotta you gotta rub some dirt on the on the I, I forgot the term but yeah yeah you, you gotta get them faces you know. I guess yeah. I mean, yeah where else would you rub dirt in and it's cuts. not taking like a in their <laughs> cuts you gotta rub it in their cuts <laughs> regardless TPSC <laughs> dropping gems I need to write this for down. real for yeah. real and um <laughs> back to the list <laughs> uh, number six a dog's sense of smell is up to one hundred thousand times more sensitive than that of a human's. While humans have about 5 million scent receptors in their noses, a bloodhound has up to 300 million. What? That's crazy. They're fucking superheroes. Dang. It's ridiculous. That's that, crazy. So they must really hate people who smell like ass. Oh, <laughs> you got to have top, top hygiene around bloodhounds. Where? The, the name of that dog is a is like a metaphor. You got to nose like a bloodhound. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, yeah. <laughs> oh, can you imagine blood out with a snake master? Oh, God. I probably want to kill how, himself. <laughs> uh, I realized how serious that was. Yeah, yeah. dog. It says three hundred million. million. I read three hundred. I was like, oh, of course, million. What? <laughs> and that we means, have that means they could smell. five million. They have three hundred 
they, <laughs> 300 million to anything is a shit Bruh, ton. Word. They, that, <laughs> they could probably smell emotion and shit. No, like. for real. That's no, what they I, say. They smell fear. Yeah, yeah like, exactly. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Dogs sense your emotion. Yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah they, they back. Yeah. Yeah. This nigga going through some stuff. Yeah. This girl sit on his lap last week. Word. Oh, that means more time with me. That's why they get happy. <laughs> All right, number seven. <laughs> Domestic cats. We'll just talk about them niggas. Domestic cats sleep an average of 16 hours per day. I believe that. Believe that. Wow. In the wild, big cats expend lots of energy hunting sleep even longer. Oh, only sloths spend more of their lives asleep. Shit. Only sloths. You're second to sleep in it. Um, next to sloths. Wow, you lazy motherfucker! But then, oh, because they spent. Imagine, imagine, like when you gotta eat, mm-hmm. you gotta work so hard mm-hmm. that you gotta sleep for another like. Yeah, yeah, day. yeah. That's true. They your, your your rest, They go like, through a lot. Where like good. everyone around them doesn't fuck with them. Imagine that. Where and it's not <laughs> even just physical. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I just. You know, ran down and killed this gazelle in front of its family. Uh-huh. Yeah. Time to eat. I'm oh, gonna go sleep for a while. Fam, imagine the mental, yeah, where the mental fam. aspect of that. Fam, I he doesn't want to kill tw- those gazelles in front of the family. Where but Twitter, do it. Twitter is wild. I don't know how he found this video. It's a video of this. Um, I, I, it's like a gazelle. They're like one of those type animals mm. giving birth. You can't tell until the end of the video. She's sitting. You can't tell if she's shitting or giving. Like she's just sitting, mm. and then she hops up, and then her baby falls out, and she runs, and then a couple of seconds later, fucking jaguar comes in the shot, and looks at the baby, and then looks at the camera. Oh no, <laughs> bro, this shit is crazy. Ah, uh, yeah. but that's nature, bro. It's yeah, unfortunate, but word. it's nature. Word. It's not yeah. pretty. It's word. not pretty. It's nature's nature. not pretty, but it's, it's nature. Word. You know what I'm saying? It's natural. It's what the fuck happens. Word. It's unfortunate though. But damn, they imagine just getting dropped in the jungle, and it's like, hey, there's some other living shit over there that you gotta eat for to real. Survive. You are not getting fed three times a day here. Where you could, you got two choices. You Maybe could once a day. You could pick the ones who are young and feeble, yeah, mm. who are beloved, yeah. or the ones who are <laughs> old and feeble who are also beloved. Yeah, to to Bro. you gotta pick it which. Which one? Yeah, but but no, I can imagine sleeping that lo- that long after, like you said, working so hard. Like, what if you hunting for two days? Mm. You know, a week. I don't, like I've seen documentaries where like they hunt for like I, an unfathomable amount of time. Like I, I, I couldn't be hungry that long. Fuck that. Where? I'm eating myself or something. No, I feel like, like if I'm regenerate. Talking about, <laughs> if I'm talking about food for like over an hour, or so that that by itself is frustrating. You yeah. start to get hangry and everything. Where? These niggas be tracking your food for a day yeah. and a half. Where? You have to hunt this bitch down. Then you gotta cook it, season it, all Duh. of that. Bro, that, that's what that's why cheetahs and jet, like they're they're great hunters. Like that's why they're so incredible. Mm. But right. um, whoa, kind of went off on that one. Where that was um, a, that was a TPSG National Geographic graphic. version of a what? wild what? ass. T- <laughs> <laughs> wow. Tangent. All right, number eight. We're off. Dogs only sweat glands are between the pads of their feet. They dissipate the majority of their heat by um, panting. A method far more effective than allowing moisture to evaporate from the skin makes sense. Mm. Especially because they got sense. all that hair. Yeah. Yeah. It'll so, probably take a while to get off. They'll yeah. probably just get their hair wet and then they be, exactly. you know what I mean? Man, they're real humans. They be having stank feet. <laughs> they're really humans. Uh, number nine, cats are this is either lefties or righties. What? <laughs> <laughs> Psychologists at Queen's University in Belfast discovered that female cats were more likely to favor their right paws, while male cats were more likely to favor their left. Oh, okay. As with humans, some cats are amb- ambidextrous. No too. fucking way. <laughs> That's Wait, crazy. Hold, hold up, hold up. So, are the are the cats who are also ambidextrous also bisexual? Who knows? <laughs> or hermaphrodites? Or her- no, yeah, 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 true, yeah. Hermaphrodite cat, wow. Mm. I never thought that'd be a sense. Is, is, is there the persecution wild. against the ambidextrous community in, in, in the cat world? In the cat, hey, science, we need answers. Or, yeah, <laughs> no, no, get to in it. The, in, the cat, in, the, in the cat world, they're like, you use both feet? What a sicko. Oh my God. You unnormal person. <laughs> Number 10. Dogs are one of only two mammal species that have prostate glands. Didn't need to know that. Mm, the other species is humans. <laughs> wow. Dogs is human. 
That's the name of this episode. Dogs is humans. <laughs> and humans is dogs. Like, cats is evil, dogs is humans. <laughs> <laughs> Where? Cat. Uh, number, uh, sorry. Sorry. 11. <laughs> number 11. Calico cats are always female. Don't know what a calico cat is. But um, we're about to have it up on the screen now. The gene of the calico... The coat color is sex linked. Oh, okay. So to express both orange and black color in the cat ha- must have two copies of the X chromosome. Rarely an, an, an abnormality produces a cat with XXY chromosomes. Oh, okay. And calico coloring. Okay. And those cats are always sterile. Mm. Didn't oh, know shit. that. Didn't know that. Number 12. Dogs aren't really colorblind. See, I knew it! I le- they do see colors, just not as well as humans. See... So oh. they just need glasses, my nigga. Yeah. Or contacts. <laughs> no, that's the name of this episode. Dogs need gla- dogs need glasses. They're fucking human. What? Well, this, glasses take this, this episode. Come on, on. prostate. Come <laughs> on, <laughs> they're fucking humans. Oh, that's why every time you see a dog in a fucking movie, yeah. it's it's like an alien or it's advanced and shit. Come on, <laughs> Air Bud. <laughs> That pug from Men in Black. Come on, man. Dogs is human. Not to mention like the six Air Buds they made. No, yeah. they made enough. <laughs> oh man, Air... for every and sport. Then his kids. Remember his kids. Air Bud is a. F- They're all talented, bro. Bro, Air Bud is. They like... all play a different sport. <laughs> Word. That's crazy. <laughs> Dog. What was wild Dog about those movies? <laughs> the premise behind those movies was always like there was always be like a ref. That came out after the initial game. Yeah. And the nigga would be like, there's nothing in the rule book that doesn't say a dog can't play. And that yeah. never made sense to me. It, it didn't. Because no, no, there's no. a lot of shit not in the, in the, the rule book <laughs> that you just assume if you got some fucking common For sense real. that you can't do. For real. It was like, you, you got, got an example? What is it? <laughs> no, that's how I know the nigga wrote this was blasted. <laughs> not off weed, not off coke, off something. I, mean, I don't know the, the specific drug, but he was high. Because <laughs> he came up with the pre- what if we have a, a dog that plays basketball? But then, you know, the level headed the person next to him going to be like, I'm sure that's against the rules. Of the- Is it? <laughs> Is We're going to have a scene when the ref comes the out. Book. Book. Nothing but, in the rule book says. But take it a step further. Mm. If someone would introduce that idea to me as a producer, I'd like, oh, this is going to be a cartoon. Yeah. Yeah, this sounds like a fuck. <laughs> this shit, this is humans in this shit. This is a live action. Like, what the fuck do you want me to do with this? Like, Mo- you want I- me to really this is a live watch action this and movie. enjoy this? I'm pretty Come sure on. I'm pretty sure there's a porn parody of, of Airbus. Oh, it's God, like- I hope not. <laughs> oh, God, I hope not. God, I hope not. Let's go to the next one. Number 13. <laughs> That'd be crazy if there was. But yeah, Word. let's go to the next Word. one. I learned this the hard way that dogs aren't colorblind, by the way. I told that story in another episode. Yeah. <laughs> Number 13. All kittens are born with blue eyes. Oh, look at that. They begin to change color about two weeks after their eyes open. Mm. Okay. okay. I mean, all, all humans can buy contacts and change their eyes. Yeah. Yeah. But I don't, I don't really know how that relates. <laughs> no. Oh, my, my niece and nephew were born with blue eyes and then they changed. Oh, yeah? So is cats human? <laughs> I knew you were gonna say that. <laughs> nah, let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Right. Number fourteen. This is interesting too. Dogs is wet noses. <laughs> Dogs, <laughs> Dogs wet noses help them smell better. Oh, okay. I feel like that makes sense. The mucus attracts and catches more chemical scent particles in the air. That makes sense. So if you have a good sense of smell, you just need to blow your nose. You need a wet nose. <laughs> Word. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Most blue-eyed white cats. Are born deaf. Blue eyed white cats. I've about 65 to 85 percent, says the Cornell College of Veterinary Medicine. Mm, a so deaf cat. Blue eyed white cats. That's yeah, why they're, they're so off the chain. Because they don't hear you. Man. Yeah. yeah. They're like, stop. No. Can't hear the haters. Where? Not yeah. at all. They just do them. They're not deaf. They're just blocking out the hate. <laughs> <laughs> Number 16. Um, sidebar, that will be the corniest shit I ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Number 16. The only dog breed that doesn't bark is the Basenji. Basenji? Basenji. It might be Basenji. <laughs> However, Basenjis do make other noises such as growls, whines, and even yodels. Mm. What the fuck? Yodels. 
Yo, if I'm if I'm sleeping, I'm my dog yodeling. I'm yodeling. kicking that shit out because he's possessed. <laughs> Get out my house, yodeling. you demon! Oh, yodeling. that's a Basenji. I've seen that before. Mm. Yodeling. They look like the bark could be mad annoying though. Where? Yodeling. yodeling. Oh, oh, that's hold a, up. We're about to hear. A that's Basenji. the dog you always see on YouTube making weird noises. That makes sense. <laughs> Your lady. All those videos. Oh, oh wow. that makes sense. All those, okay. all those videos you saw of like dogs just doing whatever the fuck, singing, doing the theme song to Batman. It's been what is it been? But Basenji, I don't know. What is that sound? He he don't have a bark box, man. <laughs> he's come installed. Make look. He's almost talking. That, fucking that's, human. That's what I was just about to say. It sounds like he's trying to talk. But Senji's are the closest thing to human. Um, but Senji's are almost human. No, it sounds like he's moving a concrete table on a wood floor. Sounds like he's wailing. <laughs> sounds like he's scratching a chalkboard. <laughs> that nigga With wailing. knives. <laughs> Word. All right, on to the next one. That's the sound Buja made when it gave him his time. (laughs) (laughs) Type of healing I'm feeling. (laughs) Hey, but Buja gets out December, though. Blah, 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 blah. Lord. (laughs) Uh, They give I and I how many years? (laughs) Uh, Number 18, dogs have no clavicles. No, number 17. Oh, sorry, 17, sorry. This is crazy. Cats don't meow at other cats. What? They reserve this sound for getting attention, Mind not blown. to mention food from humans. Wow. What? Of course they have their own language. Fuck them niggas. It's for us. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm yeah. Out oh, what if they just like talk to each other on some real shit? And nah. when we're around, it's like, oh, we got to do the cute shit for these niggas. For real. Yeah, but you notice when, like, when they're fighting and stuff, it's more like, you know what I'm saying? Like an old door in a horror movie. <laughs> and they and they add the in the oh my god yeah that's when you know it's it's about to go down yeah number I, eighteen dogs have no clavicles what? that makes sense because your clavicle you know basically is your chest yeah, <laughs> and no. dogs don't really have chestesses <laughs> you know you know your clavicle is your collarbone and yeah and if um, you think about it yeah. like our arms would have so much more like they already have a decent range of motion yeah they would have so much more range yeah of motion everybody's arm was drooped like just you know what i'm saying yeah, kind of yeah. like yeah but we could we could be able to probably yeah you, you can't stretch a dog out like that you crazy. know what i'm saying you you, right. you that's a felony <laughs> it's like shaking a baby <laughs> um 19 when cats walk, their left front leg moves in tandem with their left back leg. <laughs> really? They walk like that? <laughs> 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 Fucking losers. <laughs> Who walks like that? <laughs> um, and their right legs do the same. <laughs> the only other animals that walk this way are giraffes and camels. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. <laughs> so both really? of their left legs move This losers supposed to be left, right, left, right. They yeah, left, both. left, right, right, left, left. It makes sense though because like their left front moves and their right back stays, so their left. I mean, what? Yeah, they're like it's like that. But you know what? You can't really knock them because they're great hunters. So it's working. <laughs> what yeah. shit? And they don't got no cla- those. Are, those um, got no clavicles. Uh, we are on number twenty. Mm. Um, you can move that. Who kid? Good looks. Domestic dogs can breed with wolves. Wow. That's good the two know. animals are still related closely enough that they can mate, producing feral offspring. Wow. Hmm. Shit, okay. I might do that. <laughs> Yo, that sounds like the premise of like a, pit like a white wolf person movie. Mix. <laughs> they have a pit bull they had their entire life and they found a wolf and they mm. crossbreed it and yeah. terrorized the town or some shit. That <laughs> sounds like the, the premise wolf. to a Disney movie. Oh, yeah. Like a nigga that's half wolf, half dog. What am I? And doing through that whole like identity, yeah. <laughs> identity crisis. Am I Yo, a dog? Oh, that might it's be a called better, Wolf that, Cry. Motherfucker, <laughs> we need to we need to get on the phone with Yo, Pixar. Yo, call right? Steven Spielberg right the fuck now, my guy. We need to get on the phone with Pixar. Hey, for we real. got one for you. I read you Jay Z song "Cry" for the for the soundtrack. Yeah, where is it coming down, my guy? Hey, gotta make this wolf cry. But with, <laughs> he starts howling. <laughs> uh, with that, before we give away any more money, for real, that's yeah, about yeah. it. We just open in our pockets. Yo, Where? Sean Carter, holler at your boy. Where? Yeah. Hey, Pixar, holler at us. For we got real. a, we got an idea. All this come. See, this is why we need to have conversations for like real. this. This is where the this is this is where the shit goes down. 
But now, what, no, no, we got three left. I'm going to just run through them. All right. Just to state them. Uh, number 21, the proper name for a group of cats <laughs> is a clowder. What? Fucking losers. Clowder. A group of kittens is called a kindle. That's wow. cute because they're kittens. <laughs> uh, 22, it takes 18 muscles to move a dog's ear. Oh, big swole. <laughs> this, specificity, uh, this, <laughs> this specificity of motion helps the dog pinpoint the origins of sound much faster than human can. Uh, oh, yeah, because they, they can point the ear to wherever they want to hear. Same yeah. thing with cats, yo. They won't even move their head. Their yeah. ears will move. And, like, you say something, ears will move. But they yeah. No, 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 you're right. And then the last but not least, both cats and dogs' noses are unique, like human fingerprints. Really? It's becoming more and more common to take nose prints of dogs in case they're ever lost or stolen. That's mm. crazy. That's weird. That's crazy. You know how unique a human fingerprint is? Yeah. That's probably how that's they That's crazy. That's probably I, how they identify each other. <laughs> cuz they do Yeah, cuz they do like sniff each other and like, you know, rub noses and shit. Like, what if That's crazy. Yeah. Wow. That's I, the illest fact. They saved it. It really saved the best for last. Yeah. Yeah. That's Got crazy. nose prints and shit. <laughs> Word. But um, oh, you don't know who I am, nigga. Wow. Oh, oh man, how you oh, been, bro? Oh, Jeff. Oh, nigga, I thought you was that punter in him down. I hate that nigga. Nah, man, I escaped. <laughs> Last I heard, he got locked up. I'm back with y'all. <laughs> They could take a cat out to hit no, stuff. <laughs> but right, um, so I'm getting a signal from our producer. Hopefully, I mean, all this information helps you make a decision. Yeah, yeah. You can figure out whether you want a, a little kitty or a so little puppy. So after almost, if you want an hour, if you want of a, ch- a podcast, if you, I still don't know. No. <laughs> if you want a chowder, <laughs> no, was it a crowder? No, clouder. a clouder of cats. You losers. <laughs> you, you, like you know what a group of crows are called? A murder. A murder. A Them murder. niggas hard body. <laughs> A clowder. I'm not scared of a clowder of anything. <laughs> but what's crazy, a cat will fuck you up. Yeah. And a group of cats will kill you. Yeah. <laughs> so, but that, that's such a yeah. gay ass name. If like, you have a, well, oh, a no, name. I was about to say if you had a cloud of lions, but that's a pride. Right? That's a pride. Yeah. 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 See, you, know what, you know what a group of crocodiles are called? Nah. You can't find one better. A congregation. See. <laughs> now with that. <laughs> or alligators. It's one of the two. Mm-hmm. But with that, we got a dip. It's been your favorite podcast, and uh, don't forget hashtag Pray for Shabby. Um, hopefully, the uh, the ring lawns, uh send him back. But um, until anyway. he comes back, we're still who we are, and it's your boy, Mr. Dramatic, aka Wave Chappelle, aka. Uh, dang, a lot of my AKAs involve my beard, so I'm just gonna stick to Skip Beardless uh, for the time being. For the, for the time, time being. And this is Flocka Zulu, a.k.a. Sir Black Stoddard in the third, a.k.a. Pablo Escovich. And it's your boy, David Wilmer, a.k.a. Chico Fantastic Code. That fantastic Chico. No relation. <laughs> no relation. And uh, we'll catch you next week on the flip side. Yes, or yes, next yes. episode on the flip side. Yeah, next episode. Stay tuned.